Welcome everyone to another Tasty Tuesdays recipe. On today's menu, we have the ultimate breakfast burrito. Now for the past couple weeks, I've been breaking my fast with this recipe. It's delicious, it's super filling, it's not too high in calories, and I know you guys are gonna love it. It's also very versatile, you could add whatever ingredients you like inside. For me, today we're gonna add some cheese, some turkey bacon, some hash browns. You're gonna love it, all right? So let's get started. Okay, so we already have the turkey bacon being prepared in the air fryer. I have it cooking there. And here we have 90 grams of already cut roasted potatoes. And we're gonna fry up two eggs and half a cup of liquid egg whites. We're gonna do the, all that on the skillet. And we're also gonna probably put a bit of butter uh, just to help fry up these potatoes. And it's gonna be absolutely delicious. Don't be afraid of the butter. Just put about a tablespoon or even half a tablespoon. So if you're looking for the, actually let me show you. Here's the light butter and we're looking at for 10 grams, only 50 calories. So if you have some light butter at your local store, go pick up the light butter. If not, just use half the portion. It's 50 calories, it's gonna make the dish that much better, okay? Okay, so first you're gonna to wanna to heat up the skillet to medium heat, and you're gonna melt about a tablespoon of light butter like I showed you. Next, while that's melting, you're gonna start chopping up your veggies. Here I'm using green bell pepper. Sometimes I like to add in some onion. It's all up to you. Once, once the butter is melted, you're gonna start cooking your potatoes. These are gonna take about 10 to 15 minutes to cook well. Uh, we're also gonna add on some salt and pepper and some garlic powder. Okay, so I've been using these big tortillas these are like the jumbo ones and they're they're 300 calories each for 94 grams. Once the burrito is nicely sealed shut, I like to heat it in the air fryer or in the oven uh, just for five to seven minutes, just to get a nice crisp on the outside. Okay, so the burrito is ready. It smells amazing. You can see it. So before we take a bite, we're gonna make a quick homemade garlic spicy sauce. Very simple. So we're gonna need some Greek yogurt, some, some garlic powder, some hot sauce. This is like a zero calorie spicy uh, Mexican salsa I got at the store and just a squeeze of lemon juice. Here we have some fresh lemon. So it's gonna be about 50 grams of yogurt. And you're gonna wanna weigh out the yogurt. Okay, so we got 50 grams of yogurt and we're gonna put about a tablespoon of garlic powder. We're gonna put a squeeze or so of lemon juice. Fresh lemon is perfect, that's what I'm using. And we're gonna use a bit of the hot, the, the hot. We're gonna use a bit of the hot sauce. Okay, and I'm just gonna mix. Very simple sauce, I use this on everything, on my steak, except for when I'm having steak, I don't put the hot sauce, I just have the yogurt, garlic powder, and lemon juice. Okay. Taste test. Mmm, so hot. Mmm, so good. You taste the, the potatoes with the bacon, the melted mozzarella cheese, and the egg, and with the sauce, it's a perfect combination. Mmm, so good. 
All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Try out the recipe, you're gonna love it. Customize it the way you like. Add in whatever ingredients you like. This is what I chose, this is what I like. Um, sometimes I even have uh, sausage instead of bacon or I put a different type of cheese. So, so I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. I'm gonna go sit down and finish this. Mm.